On Fox 5, former state senator Nancy Schaefer and her husband Bruce were found dead today at their Habersham County home. Fox 5's Justin Gray is here now with more. Justin? Yeah, Russ, former state senator Nancy Schaefer was well known for championing conservative causes. Tonight, GBI crime scene investigators are at her northeast Georgia home. They're searching for clues that might tell them what led to the sudden and violent deaths of Ms. Schaefer and her husband. And I ask you, that you please rise with me for a moment of silence. The announcement was made around 7.30 this evening on the floor of the Georgia General Assembly. The bodies of former state senator Nancy Schaefer and her husband Bruce were found today at their Habersham County home. Investigators say both had been shot. Preliminarily, it looks to be a murder-suicide. Uh, the GBI has six agents on the scene, two crime scene specialists. Uh, there will be a thorough investigation. Punch 11. Mrs. Schaefer was a former Atlanta mayoral candidate. She was also a two-term state senator who represented the 50th district, including all her parts of eight North Georgia counties. Mrs. Schaefer left the General Assembly after losing a North Georgia Republican runoff in 2008. She founded the nonprofit Family Concerns, Inc. in 1986. Schaefer was an opponent of abortion and gay marriage and fought for public display of the Ten Commandments. And in 1994, Mrs. Schaefer was the Republican nominee for lieutenant governor. The 73-year-old was also a former first vice president of the Georgia Baptist Convention. Nancy Schaefer and her husband moved to Habersham County in North Georgia after living in Atlanta for 35 years. They were parents of five children, four sons and a daughter, Deidre. All right, thank you, Justin. It